Scotty. Absolutely, and they kept trying to throw parties for him, you know. But he, you know, all he said was, "Stop badgering me." Boo! Yeah, I got to, I got to warm up. It's early. Good all morning, right. five eighteen. Vinny Sue's. Happy Thursday to you. Happy Thursday to all of you as well. And boy, we are. We are just about to enter an extended period of unsettled weather, quite a contrast to what we've seen so far. Here's Viper radar on the wide view. Most all of us, I mean like 99.9% .9 of us not dealing with any precip right now in southeastern Wisconsin. It is just knocking on the door around the Dells, north of Madison, and pushing generally in a northeasterly direction. So it may skirt you folks in Fond du Lac, western Fond du Lac, northwestern Dodge County early this morning. Later on today is I think when most of us will see the precipitation. There are a couple of isolated pop-up showers ahead of this. A warm front that's lifting through the area, very unstable atmosphere. So let's focus in. I mean, really close using advanced Doppler 4 radar technology on that little dot there. And just to the northeast of Sussex, or right around Lannan, and just to the southwest of 45 and around the falls, you're seeing a little downpour. That is about it for us right now. And again, I think through most of the morning commute, you should be dry. Here's a live look from our West Bend Tower Cam. No precipitation on the ground there in West Bend and in your weather headlines. Well, we're calling it ugly and active over the next several days with rounds of rain and there may even be some periods of strong storms coming our way. Right now, very mild air compared to earlier this week. 63 in Milwaukee, 59 for you fine folks waking up with us in Waukesha. It's 62 up to the north in Fondy and 60 in Beaver Dam. Notice the contrast in the atmosphere. This is huge, and this is one of the key ingredients to produce some of those strong showers and storms. 67 in Des Moines, 37 up to the north in International Falls. Big contrast in the atmosphere, and that's what's helping to produce these showers and storms around our region. Also, strong low pressure lifting in our direction leading to the wet weather. So for today, mostly cloudy and warm, scattered showers and storms developing highs near 76 down to 64 tonight with showers and storms early. I think much of the overnight may be dry and then partly cloudy, very warm, scattered showers and storms again tomorrow. Not an all day washout tomorrow, but the chances increase late in the day and into tomorrow night down to 63. Here comes Milwaukee's one and only 3D HD 10 day outlook. Yeah, this weekend not looking to be the best. We go from warm and wet on Saturday to damp and chilly on Sunday. 58 degrees beginning of next week looking pretty good, Lisa. It's kind of hanging on by a thread. All right, uh, morning drive doing pretty